Breaking news right now. Headlines today has access to and exclusive visuals of two men who have been arrested for the murder of Deepak Bhardwaj. These visuals were taken in front of Patiala Court in New Delhi, where now the total arrest comes down to three in Deepak Bhardwaj's murder case. Chilling images which were captured on the CCTV had shown how these three had got away after murdering Deepak Bhardwaj. However, all three now in police custody. Two of them apprehended outside Patiala Court. So in total, what uh, we can break for our viewers at this point of time is four arrests have been made, three arrests and one person has been has surrendered. My colleague Atir Khan on the phone line with us. Atir, dramatic visuals coming in in front of uh, Patiala Court there where uh, the fourth accused surrendering and of course then taken into custody. Well, that's right. There seems to be some dispute. What we are learning is that the lawyer of uh, Purushottam and Sunil have come up with this claim that they had gone to the court with an intention of surrendering. But uh, the police, uh, Delhi police uh, got a better of them and they have... Uh, arrested for a short time. So uh, the, the, the lawyer is obviously disputing this uh, Delhi police claim that they have arrested him. But what is more significant is uh, Preeti with the, the arrest for a short time. Uh, now the clearer picture will be there as to uh, what was the entire story and what went behind Deepak Bhardwaj's killing. Atir, can we safely say now exactly the motive why Deepak Bhardwaj was killed? The modus operandi, all of that would be Coming out, considering the police would crack all the four male accused who are now in police custody? Absolutely. It's uh, clear that it is a Supari killing and we are also learning from our sources that an uh, amount of uh, 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 as much as 2 crore rupees was paid to them to carry out this uh, killing. But uh, the motive of uh, PT obviously remains unclear at the moment. We know that uh, after uh, the Skoda car was recovered, uh, the owner identified Delhi police got certain leads on which they started working and then yesterday with the, with the detention of Amit, the driver of the getaway car, uh, police had a lot of details with them and today they got a tip off that uh, both uh, Pushpen, uh, that Pushottam and uh, Sunil would attempt to uh, surrender at Patiala House Court and before Pushottam could reach there, uh, they have uh, rounded him up. You know, after we could come back to you, let's uh, quickly run our viewers the visuals that they are witnessing on their television screens, uh, screens at this moment. Dramatic visuals coming from outside Patiala Court there where Pushottam, the fourth Q, surrendering there, apprehended by the police, as you can see on your television screen. These visuals of Pushottam and Sunil Deepak, Ardhwaj's killers, Sunil surrender application to come up for hearing. Uh, of course, it did in fact come up for hearing a short while back. These are the latest visuals that we are getting for our viewers right now. Now, all four accused in the Deepak Bhargwaj case have been apprehended, one of them surrendering dramatically right outside the Patiala court. My colleague Aditi on the phone line with us. Aditi, just talk us through these dramatic visuals. We know you were there when uh, the fourth main accused surrendered outside the Patiala court. Yes, uh, Preeti, this incident took place at around 11, 11, 15. What we got to know that Purshottam and Sunil both were anyways coming to surrender in, from the, in the Pachala house court. In, in fact, what we got to know from the police forces is that at that time Sunil surrendered, but Purshottam tried to uh, flee from the spot. It was then that the, uh, the police officials arrested him from outside the Pachala house court. But the version of the lawyer of Sunil and Purshottam is completely different from what the police sources are telling us. In fact, when I spoke to the lawyer, the lawyer said that uh, Purshottam was there inside the courtroom and he was going to surrender but it was wrongfully that the police actually uh, 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 arrested him so probably the lawyer is saying that the police wanted to show that they had made an arrest and that way it, they, and in fact he, is, he also uh, called up 100 to file a complaint that, uh, that Purshottam mm -hmm. was uh, arrested wrongfully but as of now so near the application of surrender is going to come up in the court tomorrow at around 10 a.m. and right now the police have taken Purshottam we are yet to uh, Get to, we are yet to know where exactly the police has taken him. In fact, uh, as per the legal right. procedure, within 24 hours, uh, Purushottam is to be presented in front of the court. Briefly. You know, Aditi, showing that Purushottam was arrested and not surrender would impact the case where he is concerned. At one end, the lawyer said that he had gone there to surrender. However, the police maintaining an arrest. 
exactly preeti this has been a very high profile case in fact the police have been you know under tremendous pressure because of the fact this case happened on the 6th and today is the 26th of march and today is the 1st of april so already there has been a lot of time to actually get hold of the uh, of the killer, of the killers and in fact it was only yesterday that the delhi police had even sent out the uh, uh, the lookout uh, circulars uh, to prevent uh, pushotam and sunil from going out of the country so yes the police have been under tremendous pressure but it is only time to uh, time and we will get to know whether it was actually an arrest or whether what the lawyer of sunil and uh, pushotam is saying is actually true